Kala, thanks very much for making some time. Um, Thank you. You've uh, been engaged in a very interesting innovation and invention. Why don't you explain what you and your colleagues have been doing? Yeah, I am uh, Khalid from Egypt. I'm co-founder and CTO of Mobster. It's uh, a startup company that's working on a new uh, innovations that will help uh, the blind people uh, to go and navigate without the fear of hitting any, pl any obstacles in front of them. And also, uh, it's uh, like a wearable gadget that can be wear like a belt. Uh, it gives them, uh, it, it detects any obstacles in front of them and gives them and feedback through uh, an audible messages. So if there is an obstacle in front of them, it will tell them there is an, uh, an, uh, an obstacle right on the, on the left or on the right on the center. Uh, and also to give them uh, the recognition of some critical object like stairs or uh, chairs or doors. Uh, we are now, uh, uh, we are based in, Ka in Cairo right now. And we are here in the New York Forum Africa to uh, to network with uh, other parties and uh, and investigate more in uh, our uh, in our business model. Why did you choose this problem to tackle? Um, do you have friends that were yeah, blind? Or? Yeah, that's that's uh, how it started. Uh, actually, we have uh, we have an, uh, a friend of us uh, in our company that uh, he ha he was uh, 15 years old. He had an accident and he, he lost his sight. So back then, when we were a child, uh, I don't have uh, the know-how to how to help him and something like that. Especially, he used to be uh, more engaged in society and uh, playing and reading or something like that. Sure. But after the accident had happened, he has some sort of uh, being uh, feeling that say ha there is a barrier between him and society. So uh, I ha that has been the motivation for us when I. I go to the university, I go to the engineering university, so uh, I had uh, this idea uh, with, the, with, the help, uh, with my co-founder, uh, and then he was my, with me in the university also. Uh, if we can merge the, the two of our passion about technology and also to help uh, our friend, that, and also there is especially there is uh, like about 300 million people who are just like our friend suffering from the, the, his, his problems also. So we thought about uh, why, why we are not tackled this, uh, this field and, and start our company in that. So you know, inventing something like that, obviously it takes techno t technical knowledge, yeah. takes a bit of inspiration, the passion you clearly have, but moving it from invention to actually you know, a yeah. product that can be marketed and sold and developed yeah. That's a that's an even bigger task. Yeah. Are you finding lots of barriers in your way to that, or are you finding a clear yeah, path? Yeah, uh, sure. Uh, it's, uh, the entrepreneurship uh, ecosystem uh, here in Africa or in e Egypt specifically also is just uh, it's just growing. It's not there is no such the, the ecosystem that can help you to to more growth. Uh, uh, you we really lack, uh, of course, uh, the experience and. Uh, that we have the passion about technology, and we we know uh, we had the know how of how to implement uh, something, that, or how to invent something like that. Mm -hmm. But uh, as you said, to ha to bring it some uh, something that's commercial that can be in the hands of our uh, of, ca of our customers, it has some challenge or some obstacles that uh, right in front of us. For instance, we we need to manufacture, so there is no manufacturing facilities in Africa or in, in Egypt. So we are, we are like outsourcing the manufacturing in. Uh, Asian come uh, in like China or Thailand using Alibaba or something yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah, something yeah. like that. But the, the, the mainly the R and D and the assembling of uh, all these cameras will be in, in Egypt and our lab in Egypt. Okay. And also the marketing, you know, the the marketing we, we are now working on our uh, our partnership with uh, NGOs and uh, the large NBOs in, in Egypt or in, in the MENA region also to help us to uh, more penetrate this uh, this. Uh, this field and also help us to distribute it, uh, our product once it's ready to go to, ma to the market. Uh, there is also another obstacle: the, the funding, of course. If you are if you are working on technology and you ha you, you are saying about uh, a huge market like in Egypt, there is more than one million people sure. who are totally blind. So we, you need the, that ma uh, that amount uh, a lot of a lot of money to to get that. Uh, product into the market. So that's pretty the, the obstacles that we are facing now. We found the new forums part of our strategy to uh, scale and network with other partners that maybe help on our business.
Great. Well, good luck with this project, and I hope you can find some good partners here. Thank you.